Hi, welcome to my May Week vlog video. Uh, so if you're new here, my name is Maria and I'm a fifth year medical student studying at the University of Cambridge. So basically, May Week is a week of fun that you have after exams in Cambridge. So the exams usually run from mid-May to about mid-June and then um, you launch straight into May Week. Just to jump in, that does mean that May Week is actually in June. Uh, in this time, you have all of the May balls, you have bumps, which is a big rowing race, and just lots of other fun activities. Everybody tends to be really relaxed because exams are finally over. And most undergrads will leave after, after May week, but um, if you're graduating that year, you stay on for grad week, which is an additional week of fun and just catching up with people before you're gone. Um, so in this video, I'll be showing you what I got up to in both May week and grad week. Um, it was my first proper May week because um, our first and second years were really disrupted because of COVID. And last year I had exams in July because of um, fourth year Cambridge Clinical Medicine. So it's been my only proper May week. So I'm really excited to share that with you and hopefully you'll get a good insight into what I got up to. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Welcome to my third year May week vlog. We got sprayed Prosecco in my eyes and then we went to the camp to wash off. The zoology exams finished super late and that meant that we were launched straight into May week. It felt really good to be done and this is me at the cat's barbecue and then at pre's for my first night clubbing in months. I was launched straight into May week bumps, which is a big rowing competition on the cam. And then I did filming with the university. And after that, I had a picnic with my college family, including my college grandkids. This is campaign day two, and it was so nice and sunny every single day. This is the zoo party for the finalists, and the food was incredible, and I shamelessly took so much home. Then we had a cheeky spoons trip, which was so needed. And of course, more rowing because bumps lasts four days. Uh, and it was just so pretty. We had such a nice time being out on the river every day. Um, and then after that, it was time for my first Mabel, which is Homerton Mabel. And it was my first time at Homerton College ever, which was super exciting. This is my boyfriend, Jack. And this is us waiting in line to get in. This is what I decided to wear to the ball. They had these awesome tree people. And then this is the entrance of the college. There was like a champagne reception. This is what it looked like as it was getting dark. Sorry, the quality is so poor because of the lighting. They were screening David Attenborough documentaries here. And there were some really cool, some rides, which I didn't get time to go on, which was really annoying. This is the main tent where the main headliner was. That was Big Nasty. And I have to say, my favorite thing though is probably the Taylor Swift tribute act. The food was so good, including these donuts. They were to die for. In general though, you had to queue up for different food places and there were loads of stores you could just wait at. There was a bunch of entertainment like a casino and these like flame throwing guys and of course music in the big hall. They had like a pub and they had Jack's Gelato which does such amazing ice cream. I have to say the silent disco was probably my favourite part though. Then all of a sudden it was morning and we made it to Survivors, um, including me and Shreyas who are some of the people we like least expected to make it there. And I reconnected with a friend from school, which was super cute. I traveled back home to London for the night. This is my dog, Daisy. And here um, I'm at my friend Nicole's birthday party for her 21st, um, so I especially came back for that. This is Tribal, which is like a big rowing barbecue hog roast thing which is at downing and i had a lot of fun 
Check out this awesome rainbow. Sam and I did our massive tour of all the colleges in Cambridge. Definitely go check that video out. Then, because I wasn't tired enough, the next day I decided to work at John's May Ball as one of their clear-up workers. So we had to be there at 6 o'clock. Um, but you know what? It was actually pretty fun. Uh, I was there with a friend who you might recognise. But, um, you know, it wasn't too bad. We got paid and we got the chance to goof around in John's for a bit. And we also have the chance to buy a ticket for next year. I had a cute little rowing outing with some friends in first year. Um, I really enjoyed that, actually. Surprisingly, though, one of my favourite things that I got up to was actually kayaking. So Sam and I rented a kayak each, and we went on the river towards Grantchester. And you know what? It was so much fun. We saw so many cool animals. Um, we saw, like, so many geese, ducks, cows... But we also saw a snake. I mean, how cool is that? I didn't even know you could get those in Cambridge. Just look at the little guy swim. Look at him go. It all just felt like a bit of an adventure. And also, come on, the more hens were so cute. They're so tiny. We also got pretty close up to the cows. And as you can tell, I was just having the best time. Then I got a haircut. Side note, never get a haircut on the day of a ball. Then I went to this awesome event, which was at Murray Edwards. It was like this animal like petting event that was run by one of the vet societies. I was there with a bunch of friends, including some of my vet friends, and my boyfriend and my friend Dan. And it was so cool. Like There were so many things to see. And you could get your face painted. I think the coolest thing was getting to see the meerkats though. Like I've never been that close to a meerkat before. On the whole, I just really enjoyed it. Then that night, Jack and I went to Downing Mabel. There was so, so, so much queuing. I think it's one of those things that you just don't think about, but the queues were enormous. As a rough estimate, I'd say maybe we were in queues for about an hour and a half. There was a Prosecco reception and these really cute ice creams. And then I saw my college husband, Gustav's too. Then we got some food and started exploring everything that the ball had to offer. There were so many rides everywhere. Uh, there was a lot of different music playing and they also had a really nice fireworks display, which I really enjoyed. They also had a little casino. We got some food there and then we watched a movie which was quite a nice chill out zone. Um, we had some candy floss we were watching and then we called it a night. And that is a wrap on my Cambridge third year May week. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed editing it.